What is up, guys? Welcome to another episode of my little survival series here. Um, today, we're taking a little bit of a break from Arroway, and we're kind of out in this new landscape. Um, right now I'm growing some dark oak trees. I need a bunch of dark oak wood for what I want to do. Um, we also need horses. You can see Arroway is kind of off in the distance over here. That's a creeper farm. Um, I came out here to the plains because there are some horses that I want to tame. And I also want to start a new settlement over here. Um, so I think the first thing I'm going to start doing is uh, t t taming a couple of horses. I have a couple of saddles and a lead. So that should start us off pretty well. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go find myself a horse that I like and I'll be back. This one actually looks like it could be a good option. I like the sleek black color. I think it works. Let's see, uh, let's see if he likes us. What's up, bud? How's it going? Oh, oh, he bucked me off. He wasn't happy. Let's try it again. Ooh, that was much faster this time. What's up, dude? We're gonna be friends. It's all good. It's okay. We have another horse. He's like all polka dotted and whatnot. So that could be uh that could be a good option. We have a brown one over there. Whoa. Whoa there, buddy. What's up? Oh, those hearts look promising. Does that mean Does that mean we could play this game? Look at this. He's got a... We got a saddle on him now? He doesn't seem all that fast. I'm not sure. I don't really ride horses that much. But yeah, look at this guy. Alright guys, we got ourselves our first horse. We're gonna need a, at least one more. Probably a few more, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, I need to find a place to put him real quick, and I'll be back. Here I am, trying to build a horse stables. And I get raided. Come on. Come on, guys. I don't want to do it to you. Never stood a chance. Well. Maybe this will teach him. You know? Maybe. Maybe after this experience, they won't want to come back. Guess we'll find out. Alright guys, um, I've been working on this for a little bit at this point, and I'm, I'm liking how it's turning out so far. I'm trying to get like an oldish looking roof going, um, so I want it to look like it's kind of sagging. And that uh, dark line coming down the center of the dark oak, that's actually like the center of the build. It's just the sag is off-centered, and I kind of... I did that on purpose because I want it to look like it's not sagging symmetrically, you know? But, yeah, this is supposed to be, um, a horse stables when I'm done with it. Um, and it's gonna be a horse stables for a city that I'm gonna put right over here. They're gonna be, like, a neighboring city to, uh, Arroway over here, right? Um, but, yeah, so, it's kinda, it's turned out pretty nice so far. We'll, we'll see how it progresses. Alright, guys, so, I've made a little bit more progress. Um this little uh stable here and i don't know i'm kind of liking it it's looking not looking too bad it's looking pretty good i think um yeah so i got their roof kind of finished i put some walls in uh and i also kind of started doing stuff on the inside so we <laughs> we got a couple little like horse stalls here we got some horses in them um so yeah that's coming along obviously i want to like clean up the grass and stuff. I think it's going to remain, like, grass and dirt, but I want to throw in some, like, coarse dirt and stuff, maybe some gravel or something. Um, and then I think I want to actually create, like, a pasture, like a fenced-in pasture, kind of out in this area-ish, um, that's connected to the stables, so that, like, you could just, like, let the horses out and they can go out and roam and whatnot. Um, I think that'd be a good idea. But, uh, yeah, no, I'm, I'm kind of liking it. And so, I'm looking for a jungle. I want to 
get me some jungle wood and maybe some bamboo. Does bamboo spawn in the jungle? And I also need cocoa beans. And dude, there just aren't jungles in 1.17. I swear to God, I've generated so much terrain that I don't want to generate. Looking for a jungle, but uh, yeah, we're gonna do the thing, see how it goes. And guess what? We finally found one. And actually, I it didn't take nearly as long as I thought it was going to take, to be honest. This <laughs> was a little, a little bit awkward, but you know, whatever. But yeah, maybe just <clears throat> I need some uh, cocoa beans, I think, and I want to get some jungle saplings and bamboo if I can. But there's like actual bamboo forest now, so I don't know if you can actually find bamboo in the jungle. Dang it. We'll find out. Aha! See? I told you guys. You were all worried. I was like, no, don't worry about it. We'll find it. And look at this! Get some cocoa beans. Awesome. Um, yeah, my inventory is kind of a mess. <clears throat> but yeah, no, this is good. Uh, that's all I came here for. I guess it's time to make like a tree and get the... Never mind. All right, guys, so I just have a couple of like really basic farms going. Uh, I'm growing some cocoa beans. I need that for brown concrete. Yeah, I just need the brown dye, you know, I'm growing some uh, some jungle trees now and I'm growing some bamboo. So, yeah, we got that kind of kind of started. Also, I've made a little bit more progress over here. So we've got our horses kind of chilling in the pasture. We got this little pond here. I'm trying to get these like darker blocks. Um, around the water to make it look like it's it's wet dirt or whatever. Um, so I think yeah, that's looking pretty cool. Yeah, we we have the area fenced off. We don't really have a whole lot of terraforming or decoration going on in here at all. But yeah, I started working on this as well. So this area is like a more highly trafficked area because all the horses get funneled in through here, and so the the grass gets beaten down a little bit there. We have some hay in here. Yeah, so I'm kind of liking how it's turning out so far. All right, guys, so now I'm trying to build a couple little bee farms. But basically, you get yourself a bee nest. You put it on top of a hopper, which is on top of a chest. And uh, you put a grass block next to it, and you kind of surround it in some glass so you could uh, see what's going on. And you get a little flower in there. And you get a, uh, a dispenser facing down. And then basically the only place the bees can go is in this little area with the flower. So they go out, they interact with the flower, they get pollen, and they go back into the bee nest and they pollinate it um, for honey. And then you got this little redstone circuit. So basically you have a comparator that's just comparing into the bee nest. And once it hits the level five stage of the honey, it causes whatever you have in the dispenser um, to activate. And so if it's glass bottles, it collects uh, like glass bottles of honey, and if it's shears, it'll collect honeycomb, and that'll just kind of fall into here. So, uh, yeah, it's a pretty easy way to just gather some honey and honeycomb passively while you're doing other projects, so we're gonna get to work on this. So it starts off with just putting some glass blocks down, I guess. And you want to get all the way around, like so. I suppose you kind of want to also be up here. Um... And then, you get your little bee nest, which I didn't do at all. Plop that sucker down here, and, um, yeah, let's see. Then we want to get our dispenser facing down, like so. So that bee should be locked in there now, assuming there's a bee in there. I'm pretty sure there's, there's bees in all of these. Um, I thought I was kind of being careful about that, but, yeah, I, uh, I suppose we'll see. And then, I think, we just kind of built this little contraption over here. That comes out, we want a block here. Um, I actually don't know if that should be a glass block. But, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll figure it out as we go. Oh, this is a problem. I didn't lock them in. Oh no, see, we're already messing up, ladies and gentlemen. It's okay, though. Um, yeah, once <laughs> once they get back in, I guess we'll lock them in there. 
Yeah. <laughs> it has to be covered up. Totally. So, yeah, no, we'll just, we'll work around this for the time being. Uh, I'll get my handy-dandy scaffolding block. Because, why not? You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, and we get some redstone here. And then we just throw this comparator down. Not there. Certainly not there. It's right over here. And yeah, that should be all good. And now we kind of have to wait for these guys to go in there. Which, yeah, that's fine. And so, yeah, redstone doesn't travel through glass blocks. <laughs> which we're supposed to know. But, you know, whatever. It's, it's not a big deal. Look, <laughs> now everything's working. <laughs> yeah, not, nah, dude, we're pros here. We know what's going on at all times okay guys so i think we got that all sorted um oh no it's awkward yeah so we have all these farms i think working let's check this out um yeah that's getting honey that's getting honeycomb that's getting honey that's getting honeycomb and this should be getting honey as well if i can look at this yes so yeah, so now we're gonna, we're gonna be passively farming honey and honeycomb a little bit while we uh, continue working over here. So yeah, that's exciting. We also should be able to make some scaffolding. So yeah, that's exciting. This is a handy block. Um, I can finally actually work with it. So that's dope. So how do these work? I mean, how do you make a, a beehive? Do you need wood? Okay. So yeah, we sort of have plenty, don't we? Just something like this. So now we could just make as many of these as we want. What about the honey? How does honey work? Look at that. So we could just make honey blocks now. This is perfect. I actually really like these blocks. This is fun. <laughs> we need more of this. We need more of this stat. Alright, dude. So I've been kind of busy. <clears throat> I've started working on this watchtower here. Uh, started putting a roof on it. Kind of got it finished off. I started putting some of these walls in a little bit. Ow. Um... So, yeah, it's looking okay. I think, I think we're gonna have to rework it a little bit. It looks fine from here, but it looks a little, looks a little jank from over here. Um, I'm not sure how that happened. It's, it's a part of how I built it, I think, because it's not like a symmetrical circle build. Yeah, and then I've started kind of outlining the entrance over here. So I think I want, like, the entrance to this castle area to come in through here i want to build up a lot of the like the dirt and stuff around here to make it look like it's more dug into the mountain um maybe kind of like how uh in like game of thrones how you get in um from the north through the ice wall something kind kind of like that not quite like that but a little bit um so yeah you'd actually like enter in through here and it'd be like all built up around here and then that's kind of how you get into this uh this city um and then yeah the walls obviously are going to come all the way around and there's going to be bustling life happening in here so yeah that's kind of what i'm working on right now uh it'll be pretty cool okay <clears throat> so i have continued outlining the uh the wall i want for the city and i'm i'm kind of liking how it's looking I'm j i've just been following kind of the landscape so far i don't have like a specific design necessarily set for the wall but i kind of like how it looks just kind of following the natural curvature of the landscape um so i think we're going to continue doing that um but yeah i'm kind of happy with it so far also guys i did not light up in here at all and it is dangerous down there <laughs> we need to deal with this immediately I keep moving look at all of them that's a creeper. Get rid of that dude. 
Dude, I feel like a C-130 right now. Raining down lead on these guys from above. The only difference is the accuracy. Let's just send it, huh? We are in danger. Let me tell you. Look at this, dude. It's a firefight. This guy's putting armor on. Ooh, that was scary. I don't even have torches. Come on. What am I doing? Alright, we got one carrot left. Let's get out of here, huh? Let's see. Let's see if we can pull this off, eh? Look at that. Smooth. Alright, so I'm going to start building the second watchtower. And I'm not totally convinced I like the first one. I was trying to like just freehand it and make it look kind of like it was just put together randomly, which is kind of what it looks like. I don't think I like it that much. So this time around, I'm going to try to make just a circle, like an actual real, real human person circle. And so, yeah, we're going to put that together and we're going to see if we like how that looks. I was kind of trying to avoid doing that in the first place, but it's probably just going to look better. So yeah, let's, uh, let's put this together and compare them. So this probably comes as a shock to no one, but the tower where I actually just formatted a circle and then built it up happens to look better than the one that I did freehand. Um, so who could have guessed that? Yeah, so we're probably going to end up taking this thing down and rebuilding it to be like a circle. I think I want it to be a little bit bigger, though. I think it looks a little bit too small for my taste. So we might actually take both of them down and then rebuild rebuild them. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see what happens. With that being said, guys, that was probably all I have time for today. We we got a fair amount done, so we kind of put these stables together. Um which are starting to look pretty good. I kinda of liking it. We also we kinda of got a little makeshift bee farm going on. You know, so that's getting us uh some honey. A little bit. This kind of hasn't been loaded in for a lot of what I've been doing, I don't think. But yeah, it's gonna us a little bit of honey and some honeycomb. Um, we also found a jungle. And we got some bamboo, so we could finally get some scaffolding. We also got some cocoa beans going, so that's pretty good. And we kind of started putting this uh, this city together. I mean, we've we've mainly just started with a, a makeshift wall so far, but I've cleared out. You know, some of these big hills and stuff that have been here. So, yeah, we've made a fair bit of progress, and I'm, pr I'm pretty happy with it. Um, but, yep, I think that's all I have time for today. Uh, but thank you guys for watching, and uh, I'll see you next time. If you liked it, feel free to hit that like button. Uh, if you want to see more, feel free to hit subscribe, and yeah, I'll catch you guys around.